guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I am filming a swatch party for you guys. I recently picked up the ColourPop Excarucci eyeshadow palette and blush palette. So if you're interested in seeing swatches, just keep watching. So I actually got this palette in last night, but I did tell my Instagram stories family that we went to see Beauty and the Beast. And so I wasn't able to film this video for you guys yesterday. So hopefully you don't mind if it goes up a little bit late, but I thought better late than never, you guys would like to see some swatches of this palette. Now I did restock today. I don't know if it's sold out, but I did pick two backups up. Um, I'm thinking of doing another giveaway. My Jaclyn Hill giveaway is technically still happening. I already passed 550 subscribers, but We've been so busy, you guys. I am waiting to get some help from my husband on how we're going to figure out like everyone that's subscribed and how to pick a winner randomly. So if you guys are interested, you know, just go ahead and subscribe to my channel to get a chance to win the Jaclyn Hill X Morphe palette, which also sold out again because um, I think it restocked. Was it like Tuesday or something like that? So if you're interested in that, I just wanted to mention that. Let's get into swatches. So this is the packaging for the eyeshadow palette and this is the size of the eyeshadow palette. I believe it is the same size as the Yes Please palette and I just put up a video on the Yes Please palette um, comparing it to the Natasha Denona palette. So if that's something you're interested in, I'll pop the link in the uh, cards so you can check that out. But this is what the palette looks like and I was completely attracted to these shades so these are the shades on the inside of the palette and I actually did use this to create my eye look for the day I basically popped this matte shade in my crease and then my lid shade is the shimmer shade right here now off the bat basically the first two rows are metallic shimmer shades and then the last row is matte which I think is very smart and so I'm gonna go ahead and swatch I just want to make sure I believe the the names are like backwards, so it's kind of annoying. Okay, so this is the first row. I'm going to take my watch off. Okay, so this is the first row swatch. Now, honestly, when I was swatching these, they didn't look so pigmented, but when I swiped them across my hand, it actually looked a lot more pigmented. You can't really judge this palette and say, oh, it's $16, so I'm not going to expect much from it, because honestly, these palettes for $16 bucks, like blow me away. So the first shade is Ladylike, then we have Babe, Dainty, and Cheek. Super pretty shades. I think all of these would look gorgeous on the lid. The next row is also metallic. So here are the finger swatches. Let me go ahead and swatch them down here. Ooh, pretty. Do you guys see that? Super pretty, like pinky shades, just like a nice break from all the warm palettes. I think it's still warm, but it's not like obnoxiously sunsetty. So we have Mademoiselle, Gal, Empress, and Philly. And they're so pretty. I used Gal, I believe, on my lid today. It's one of the more sheer metallics. It has like a matte base and then shimmer in it, but I think it's fabulous. And then finally, let's swatch all our mattes. So here are the finger swatches, and then I'm going to swatch them on my hand. And I thought, for the most part, this blended really well in my crease. So I have Dear, I have Missy, I have Damsel, and I have Duchess. So these are all 12 of the shadows swatched on my medium tan warm skin tone. <laughs> I have the worst time explaining that to people, but anyway, I did play with this palette. Usually I don't play with it until I swatch it for you guys, but I couldn't wait and so far I really like it. Like I said, I picked up two of them today, so there will be a giveaway coming up on my channel. If you guys are interested, definitely subscribe so you get notified when that giveaway goes up. Now next is the blush palette and this is called Her and there's three shades in here. It's called the highlighter's called Lassie, the blush shade's called Mistress, and the bronzer's called Dame. Now, I was really bummed because when I opened up the palette, the highlighter was actually, like, cracked into bits. Now, this is my third product from ColourPop that's been broken, um, which I don't think is terrible because I do order from them quite a bit. 
but it is kind of getting old, so I am going to have to email them. They will probably send me a replacement. I mean, every time I email them, I hope they will, but, you know, nothing's really guaranteed when it comes to this stuff. So, um, yeah, I'm just so bummed that it's broken, um, but let's swatch. And then this blush shade is very pretty, and then there's a bronzer, which I think should work with my skin tone. So the highlight is definitely a goldeny champagne-y like very true gold color and the blush is like a nice plum pink like a rosy pink and then the bronzer I think might work for me it's definitely more gray tone so it's not a warm bronzer but there are the swatches from the face palette I don't want to pick it up because it's a crumbly hot mess but yeah that is all my swatches from the ColourPop X Karuchi is this part three and then I got this for free uh, for replacing my order, but I think I'm going to throw this in the giveaway with the eyeshadow palette because it's an ultra gl glossy lip and the shade is like a very dark brown. And I have something like this from the ultra glossy lineup, um, so I don't really need another brown lip gloss shade, so I'm going to be giving this away as well. Okay guys, that is it for my swatch party video. I hope you enjoyed it. If you are new to my channel, don't forget to subscribe down below so you get entered into my Jaclyn Hill palette giveaway. I will most likely be announcing the winner this weekend, so thanks again for everyone for bearing with me. Hope you liked this video, leave me a comment down below if you have any questions, suggestions, brilliant insights, I would love to hear from you guys, and I hope you guys have a great rest of your day. Bye guys!